वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स नाउ आई हैव डिसेक्टेड द स्ट्रक्चर्स व्हिच आर इनक्लोज ऑन द फ्री मार्जिन दैट इज फ्री राइट मार्जिन ऑफ द लेसर मोमेंटम दिस इज द स्टमक दिस इज द लेसर कर्वेचर एंड हियर वाज द लेसर मोमेंटम गोइंग टू द लीवर ओके नाउ दिस वाज द फ्री मार्जिन ऑफ द लेसर मोमेंटम डीप टू व्हिच इज प्रेजेंस ऑफ द एपिप्लोइक फोरामिना वेयर माय फिंगर इज गोइंग ओके i hope you are able to see the finger going into the epiploic foramina now i have removed the peritoneum covering of the lesser omentum at the free margin to expose the three important structure which are going into the porta hepatis are coming out of the porta hepatis now most anteriorly and to the right side this is the gall bladder here you can see the green color gall bladder on to the inferior surface of the liver and from gall bladder the duct which is coming is called as the cystic duct from the porta hepatis and the bile duct is coming hepatic duct what is called as hepatic it is bringing the bile bile and which may go to the gall bladder for storage and concentration after that cystic and the uh, the common hepatic uh, i mean say hepatic duct will unite together to form the common bile duct see this this is the union and this is the common bile duct which will ultimately go and open onto the second part of the duodenum on the its medial surface second structure is here and this is the hepatic artery which will near the porta hepatis will divide into right and left hepatic artery for the right and left lobes of the liver this is coming from the celiac trunk a branch from the common hepatic artery now we go to this see the relation between the hepatic artery and that of the common bile duct will always lie on to the right side and the hepatic artery it lies on to the left of the common bile duct then if you just lift this two structure there is an another structure which lies posterior to it and this another structure posterior to it is this the portal vein this is that portal vein is here you can see this portal vein where i am just putting the tip of the i will just pass the forceps deep to the portal vein see this i have just put the forceps deep to the just let me use the the clot has come okay so here is the portal vein and then my forceps is deep to the portal vein and then this is the portal vein quite wide vein which is going into the porta hepatis here and this lies deep to the uh, hepatic artery and that of the bile duct so these three structures which forms the anterior boundary of the epiploic foramina also in which my finger is going uh, they are there thank you very much for watching this video